Welcome to this Wargaming Recon video for our Patreon backers and potential backers. I am Jonathan J. Reinhardt. I'm the creator and the host of Wargaming Recon, which is a podcast that discusses historical and New England gaming. I've been doing this since 2006, and you may have seen the previous video I did for Patreon. If not, welcome to this new one, and even if you did see the other one, welcome anyway. So this is a new video that I want to share with you because I, I'm asking for your help is really what it is. I, as I said, I've been doing Wargaming Recon since 2006, and I, I need your support to keep the show going and to keep it at the high level of production and quality that it is. So I am a new dad. I have a baby girl in... I've talked about on my show the difficulties of that and also difficulties with my um, wife having a new job. And so I need a little extra financial boost to just um, be able to attend some of the conferences that I cover and get all the cool review products and be able to keep the show going at that really high level that I try to keep it at for you. So we're giving recon, right? This is a podcast where I have all sorts of really amazing content. I cover conventions like Huzzah up in Maine, Havoc, which is perhaps the oldest historical wargaming convention in the U.S., but definitely in New England, and also Total Confusion, which is this amazing tabletop convention that takes place down in southern Massachusetts. It has old school role playing games. It has board games, tabletop miniatures, and just all sorts of interesting things. And I'm going to say unique content there. So I go to these, I cover them, I interview people from there and release episodes. I talk about them. I also have some superb guests. I've had Henry Hyde on. He's a wargaming author, and people might also know him from his work with both Battle Games Magazine and now Miniature War Games Magazine. He's an editor of that. Podcaster Neil Shook has been on. Authors Diane and John Sutherland. They used to run the War Game Holiday Center in Crete, and they've written lots of military history books between the two of them. Magazine editors Jasper Ortiz and Yasha Browers have been on. They're affiliated with Karen Sawai Publishers, so I've talked about Ancient History Magazine, Ancient Warfare Magazine, War Game Soldiers and Strategy. I've had game designers on, tons of them. Uh, just to name a few, Russ Lockwood, Peter Bryant, Jay Libby, and like I said, a lot of others. And then I talk about different aspects of the wargaming hobby. So it's not all historical wargaming. It's not all New England gaming. Those are the focuses. But I, I, I try to cover everything, do re reviews about different products, and just kind of give you a glimpse into the hobby to share things that I think are of interest with listeners or potential listeners like you. I've been doing this particular show since 2006, but I also have two other shows that uh, are kind of off again, on again. I've done Gamer Tunes, which has been uh, a show that focuses on music that either is intended for gaming or that gamers could use as inspiration and background for their gaming aspects. And then Geeks Explicitly is a weekly show that I have done where I just kind of talk about all aspects of geek life on there. It's kind of like another side of things that aren't appropriate for Wargaming Recon, go there. I've been a guest on other podcasts. I've been on Ruthless Diastema to talk about Wargaming and Indie Talks. I've been on the Gate Stormers and Stone Ape, and the Mythwits has, has me on. So I've been doing this basically for a while. And hopefully you're familiar with my work, and if not, you can find it at wargamingrecon.com. As I said, I need your help, but I don't expect to just have you give me money. That's not how it works, right? I like to give more value than what I receive. So I have these cool backer levels that you can uh, choose from, uh, whatever fits your monetary situation. And I want to say that the levels start at a dollar per month. That's less than what you would pay for like one of those Vallejo paint pots, it's less than a cup of coffee. So a dollar per month gets you in as a backer for me here at Patreon. And then I have other levels. So the dollar level I'm calling like the tip jar, right? It's if you go to the coffee shop and you're like, you know, thank you for the cup of coffee and you put a buck in. You do that and then that gets you all episodes 
before non-backers, and you get behind-the-scenes content. All Patreon backers get these two things. And so the tip jar level, the dollar per month, is for someone who wants to help out, uh, maybe doesn't have a whole lot of disposable income, or wants to give this backing thing a try on Patreon. The next level up I have is a brand new level, and I'm excited to announce it here in this video. It is the $5 a month level, or what I'm calling the bumper sticker level. So this is a cool reward level because you back the show for $5 a month, and then every month in which you back at that price point, I will send you one Wargaming Recon bumper sticker. I don't have these made just yet. They're not actually in my hand, but I will have them, and they'll be available so I can send them out to you. I will do this every single month that you back at this level. So let's say you back in January, you back in February, and you back in March at this $5 a month level, the bumper sticker level. Each of those months, I'll mail you a bumper sticker, a Wargaming Recon bumper sticker. You can put it on your car, you can put it on your fridge, you can put it on your wall, whatever. And I, I will continue to do that for every single month that you back at the bumper sticker level. You could also choose to back at what I'm calling the think by name level. And that's a little awkward, right? But how it works is you contribute $7 per month, and then I thank you by name and every single episode of the show where you back at that level. New episodes come out at least twice a month, roughly every other week. So I will thank you by name. Uh, let's say someone named Jonathan is backing the show. I would say, well, I want to thank my Patreon backers. I want to thank Jonathan for his very kind support and his kind generosity through Patreon and how I can't do it without him and other Patreon backers like him, which is true. I need your support to make this happen. So you will be thanked by name, and that's $7 a month. Plus, like I said, all backers get that behind-the-scenes content, and you also get episodes before non-backers. What is this behind-the-scenes content? That could be extra audio that didn't make it into an episode. It could be some video. Maybe I do something special just for backers, or I could do um, like a blog post, for example, that goes just to Patreon backers. It gets sent to you and gives you some of the things that I was thinking about or the motivation behind episodes or, or extra information that I wasn't able to put in that episode, but that I wanted to make available to backers like you. On top of this, there's a couple other episodes, a few, actually three, uh, of levels. You could choose to back at $9 per month and you will receive a postcard, a Wargaming Recon postcard. I will physically mail it to you every single month. And you'll get this. It'll have the Wargaming Recon logo on it. And then on the back of the postcard will be a personalized message from me to you. I really enjoy this. This is my absolute favorite backer level, partly because I think in this day and age, it's uncommon for any of us to receive mail that isn't either junk mail or a bill. I remember the days when you could get a letter in the mail and that was common and you'd look forward to it and you'd be able to receive these and you want to see what people had to say and then you'd want to write back. And so to be able to have this exchange of ideas and information is really cool. Plus, I think it helps us to get to know one another better. So I really enjoy doing the postcards and it's a level that regardless of it, the price point of it, the, uh, of it being $9 a month, I just hope more people choose this level because it's so much fun to be able to send you that postcard that you have it in hand. And then I've seen backers take photos of them and put it on social media and the excitement that they have. I'm really hoping that this level will spread in popularity. You can also do a $15 a month pledge and that'll get you a measuring tape, a special Wargaming Recon measuring tape. And I have that here, you can see, and it's really cool. This is a great size because you can fit it in your pocket, you can keep it in your gaming bag. It's small enough that you know you can always have it with you. I don't know about you, but I've been out gaming and got into the gaming store or the venue and realized I don't have a measuring tape and I need it for the game I'm playing. So then you go and you buy one if they have them there and you're spending a lot more to have that or you have to go to the hardware store and get one and they're so big and clunky. This fits perfectly into your pocket so you can have it with you at all times. It has all the measurements. It's great size. Just it, it works really well. That's nine dollars a month, and you'll receive that. 
just it, it's cool because again I get to mail that to you. However, this I want to say just mainly because I can't imagine you wanting more than one. But this is a one-time only thing. So I see people choosing to back at this level to get the measuring tape and then choosing to go to a different level, such as the postcard level where you get that postcard every month, such as this. I want to also mention that both the measuring tape and the postcard levels include being thanked by name in every episode. I wanted to add that as extra value for you so that not only are you getting these physical items, but you're also being thanked by name in new episodes of Wargaming Recon. And then the kind of top level that there is right now is $22 a month, and you will receive a Wargaming Recon t-shirt. Now, I'm going to tilt this forward and just kind of sit back. This is my special black Wargaming Recon t-shirt. Uh, the only people who have the black ones are myself and guests. You will get one of the really cool white Wargaming Recon t-shirts. It's the same logo and everything. It's just it's in white. That'll be sent out to you as part of this if you choose to back the show at $22 a month. And on top of that, you'll also be thinking by name in every episode. Uh, you might want multiple t-shirts. Uh, I know I do. I love getting multiple t-shirts of all sorts of different things. So this is continual. As long as you're willing to back the show up for $22 a month, I'll send you another t-shirt. The only limit, and I, I hate to say this, but the only limit to this is that this is a level limited to people with mailing addresses in the United States. And the reason for this is that shipping costs for a t-shirt, which to me don't seem like they should be a lot, but t-shirts shipping costs to overseas is astronomical. And as such, there's no way that I could have a semi affordable level here for international backers. I, I would have to make this so much more expensive that I would honestly feel so guilty at saying you need to back it at whatever dollar amount in order to get a t-shirt. $22, I think is reasonable. Uh, you get the t-shirt, you get it every month. You could do it for 12 months, the whole year, and you're going to get 12 t-shirts. It's pretty cool. It includes shipping and all that kind of stuff. So these are the backer levels, and you're probably wondering, okay, that's cool, but how does this work? How do I do Patreon? Because maybe you've never done Patreon before. And when I first started with Patreon, I was like, oh, I got to learn all this stuff. So as a backer, as a potential, potential backer, you want to go to our Patreon website, which is wargamingrecon.com slash Patreon. And once there, you just scroll down the page. The page talks about information about the campaign and what's going on and what Wargaming Recon is and all that sort of stuff. You scroll down. It's near the bottom. It has all the reward levels listed. You click on the reward level that you want to use. It will then take you to another page where you are going to confirm that that's a level you want. It'll say continue on a big button. It's like reddish orange. You click on that. Then if you don't have a Patreon account, it'll prompt you to sign up for one. Or if you do have one, you just log in. You're going to add your payment information. If you don't have it in there, you can pay by credit card or PayPal. Both work and both are easy uh, to do. If you have questions with that, the people at Patreon have amazing customer support, so I strongly recommend talking to them. Uh, I'm happy to help if I can, but again, it, they know Patreon inside and out. So you'll add your payment information, get that all set up, and then you confirm your pledge, and that'll be that. When you do your pledge, you can also choose a maximum monthly contribution so that like I said, these pledge levels, they are per month. It's you know $5 a month for a bumper sticker. It's $9 a month for a postcard. Uh, but let's say you don't want to do more than $10 a month. You can put that in as your maximum contribution for the month. Um, so you won't be charged more than that, which is very important to know. But again, this is tied to these levels, and they only happen once a month. One of the beauties of Patreon, I think, is that not only are you able to support People like me who you like what we do, and I, I hope you're becoming a backer because you do enjoy Wargaming Recon and you get value out of it, entertainment out of it. 
But it adds an extra layer to it because you get direct access to me through Patreon. When you become a backer and you go to that wargamingrecon.com slash Patreon page, you can leave comments on all the stuff I put out. You can get in touch with me that way. So you get direct access, which is maybe even easier than sending an email or through Twitter or through Facebook. So you get that special access to me. And then I also use this where I put up a lot of content to give to you where I will share ideas and blog postings and I'll talk about things before they come out on the show. I will get you input about stuff so you can really help to shape the show and what's going to be happening on Wargaming Recon in the future. And that's exclusive to my kind supporters like you on Patreon. So you have that whole other side of things, which I think is really cool. So you're able to not only support people like me, but you're able to help be part of what we do. And this is why not only do I use Patreon as a creator to um, for your generosity, but I also use it to back other people. Uh, I've found some other podcasters who I think are doing amazing things and I want to support them and I'm supporting them through Patreon. So thank you for taking the time to listen and watch this video. And if you're not already a Patreon backer, I hope you will become one. You can send questions to me by emailing me at Jonathan at wargamingrecon.com. And if you're our ba- already our backer and you are watching this because you want to see what's new with the backer levels and what's going on, I just want to thank you for your very kind support and your generosity, and I hope that you'll continue to be a backer here and that um, you know we're able to create something wonderful together and have amazing new content at Wargaming Recon. So once again, thank you so much for your time and your generosity, and as listeners of Wargaming Recon know, I can't end any sort of video or uh, podcast episode without one little bit of information. And that is, no matter how busy you are in your lives, no matter how much time you're thinking about backing a certain Patreon uh, campaign, you know you have to, you gotta, you need to keep on gaming. Thanks again for watching.